Chapels. NBC 29's Elizabeth Holmes is live in the newsroom now to show us why Henley Middle School is now nationally known for one of its after school groups. Good evening, Elizabeth. Good evening, Stephen Casey. A group of eighth graders came together to learn the ins and outs of the Constitution, not as a homework assignment, but simply because they wanted to. After months of hard work, preparation, and numerous competitions, they got to bring home some gold. I was really interested in learning more about American government and what it means to be an American citizen. I think it really paid off. For Evan Shu and the rest of this team, called We the People, taking an interest did pay off. So this is the state's one, and it's engraved on the back, and this is the national's one. After multiple competitions testing their knowledge of the Constitution, the team placed second nationwide. It was incredible. The entire room went crazy. We were all like jumping up and down. We were so excited. Getting here was not easy. Constant studying and testing on top of their regular schoolwork was hard enough. Add competing virtually on top of it. In a room with other people, you can like make eye contact. You're talking face to face. You can read their body language so you can kind of get an idea of what they're getting at. Over virtual, you're kind of missing all of those cues. But it's good to be in the same room as your friends when you're, uh, or your colleagues when you're also competing virtually because you can like give them a nudge under the table when you think they should answer the question or something. It's something their teacher, Pam Curry, is proud of. So much of what we do is affected by the government and a lot of times students don't realize that and this is allowing them to develop a better understanding of how government impacts them, what their role is within the country and kind of how they can um, initiate change. Not only did they gain a new set of medals for their hard work, they gained new friends along the way. It brought people from all uh, sort of different parts of the school together, whether their main interest be athletic or academic, uh, no matter what their favorite subject was, no matter who they were. We the People was a really great time to bring a bunch of different people together and make new friends. Now, not all of these students want to go into law or politics, but they say the skills they have learned from this group will guide them in anything they do. Live in the newsroom for the last time, Elizabeth Holmes, NBC 29 News at 6. All right, Elizabeth, thank you so much, and good luck in your next endeavors. We appreciate your hard work. Well, the